Yeah. Yo, um, I'll see if you can help me out a little bit. Ow. Uh, I, I can try, but I've had a night. What's going on? Um, I was wondering how easy uh, restraining orders are to get. Because banning Wrangler from the gas station is not enough. This guy keeps... A day after our charges got dropped, hey he's guys, circling the I gas station and... Lost I'm just doing no, stupid No, I don't shit. smoke weed. Sorry, guys. Give me a sec. Um... This guy's been circling the gas station with the motor unit for the past 20 minutes. And nobody just wants it or nothing. And he's banned from the gas station and uh, he's... I don't know. I don't know what to do yet. I, I don't know what to do either. I'm in my wit's end. I... Uh, if it's nothing right now, it's okay. I just want to address the problem because yeah, this is going to keep happening I, until I can use something like... Uh, like I said, it's okay uh, if you don't have an answer right now. I don't, I'm not expecting that. No, I, I don't know, Jack. I, uh... I'm kind of at the point where it's like... Uh, I don't know. I, I, I'm, I'm really at the point where it's like I just, I don't even want to wake up here anymore. This, all of this shit is just constant. It's just consistent bad faith from everyone. No one will deal with each other like adults. I, I, I'm just, I don't know. I can't do this shit anymore. I, I'm gonna talk to some people about it. I, I know what's going on. I've dealt with some other issues tonight. I'll uh, I'll try to ask around and see what can be done. But to be honest, uh, when someone's a cop, uh, it's pretty hard to file a restraining order against them. Uh -huh. And, you know, there's nothing like I can really do in the moment or anyone can really do. Because you'd basically have to prove that it's like bad faith of what's happening. And... You know, it's hard to prove that because they could always just come up with some excuse of like, I saw, you know, this type of car speeding by there and I wanted to check in and see if it was the same person. And no one can disprove that because there's no way to, you know, say that that person that didn't happen. Yeah, I understand what you're saying. It's it's fucked. I, look, I I don't know, buddy. I, I'll, I'll look into it, but yeah, just your let hopes me know. Up. honestly, look, I, and I, I'll just tell you this at the end of the day. And, and I would, in this city of all places, I think this is normally advice I wouldn't give because I think it kind of goes against the whole point of being in this city. But if someone is literally going to do anything they can to harass you or mess with you, and you know that they are going to abuse anything you do or say, um, I, I just wouldn't respond to them. As a criminal, as a person, as a civilian, you have the right to actually just remain silent. So if someone comes up to me and starts talking to me, and, uh, you know, I knew it was in bad faith all the time, I'd just stop answering them. And if they, you know, instructed me that I was detained when I didn't talk to them and I started walking away, I just wouldn't say anything. I'd stop, I'd put my hands up, and I'd say nothing until I got my attorney. I, I really don't know what else to tell you. This, this. Yeah, I mean, I, I was just sort of hoping for the restraining order for that. I mean, it's the same idea. I just don't want to talk to this guy ever. I, I don't. Yeah, I just, I don't think we can, I don't think you can issue a restraining order for a judge or for a cop. All right. I mean, just. Uh... Unfortunately, there's no way for me to stop someone from, you know, doing their duty. Right. And, yeah. I, and I can't do that. I wouldn't want to because the whole idea is that they're doing their duty in good faith. Yeah, I get it. Well, I, I don't know. In the city, there's nothing I can do for you. I, I just, you know. Okay. All right, that's all know, right. Buddy. I just want to see if I can get some advice or something. It's all good. I appreciate it. Yep. See ya. Okay, I'll see you. Okay,